Welcome back to Take Apart. This is my Steam Deck and I have drilled few holes in it to improve cooling. Precisely calculated mod that actually works while keeping case airflow present to cool down components on motherboard. Here again, 1TB LCD Steam Deck with transparent back cover without holes, pretty cool. Let me show you the temperatures while I play this asphalt car game. Mm, only one I could afford from Steam. Let's monitor GPU and CPU temperatures and also fan speeds. I went 4 rounds so Steam Deck should be nice and warm. Same test will be done after modifications so make sure to check the results. While I play while performing the test, you should subscribe and comment below your favorite game for Steam Deck. The highest temp for CPU was 67 degrees and 65 degrees for GPU. Also fan speed was maxed out on 3200 RPMs. Now let's quickly switch to desktop and check battery temp is on 33 degrees, SSD NVMe sensors, sensor 1 on 70 degrees and sensor 2 on 60 degrees degrees celsius. All temperatures are pretty high. So let's start. Grab the case and remove 8 Phillips screws. 4 outer ones are longer and 4 inner ones are shorter. Download my PDF template from my website, print it out and check if 32mm scale is actually 32mm. This is crucial step. Template on right is 4 aftermarket Steam Deck covers without Valve logo and one on the left side is 4 original Steam Deck cover with Valve logo. Cut out one you need Make sure to keep red dots with template as those are screw holes aka aligning points. As you see, holes will be centered with fan. Next step is to take apart Steam Deck. Make sure you remove SD card before and here it is, naked Steam Deck. Alright, I'll put aside all except back cover and will puncture template with screw directly to the screw hole. Just like so. Same for second one, perfect. Now I will use masking tape to securely hold template on its place. As last thing you want is template to move during drilling. This should be enough. Holes are drilled with 2mm drill bit. There are 56 holes to be drilled. So take your time and start drilling. Also clean your drill bit during drilling. This plastic debris can tear the template. What a job. Now I will taper down edges with 4mm drill bit. Be careful not to drill through and also from outside. I will just spin drill bit opposite way to make edges bit nicer. Now back to the desk and my freshly drilled Steam Deck back cover. It looks like a million dollars. Let me pop it back to my Steam Deck. Oh yeah, holes are right on the fan. Spot on. This mod will allow fan to suck colder air from outside while keeping airflow inside a Steam Deck case. So now there are two intakes and one exhaust. Let me play the same game four times just like before the mod. There are aftermarket cases with holes for fan but holes are too big and that in my opinion causes lower airflow inside the case that can negatively affect the components on motherboard this was mentioned on reddit where i was looking for reviews for such a steam deck case so with all my knowledge and both i decided to come up with my own way to this problematic my holes combined area is smaller than area of fan intake causing fan to still suck significant air from inside of Steam Deck and that portion of air is sufficient to cool down components with passive cooling on the motherboard. But hey, let's finish the testing and see the results. So CPU is on 60 degrees and GPU on 56 degrees while fan speed is 2200 RPM. Whoa, that's a huge difference. 6 degrees cooler for CPU and 9 degrees cooler for GPU while fan speed is 1000 rpm slower. Imagine if you blast that fan on full speed as it was spinning that way before the mod. Temperatures would be much lower. Let's quickly see desktop. Battery temp on 28 and SSD NVMe sensors on 62 and 42. Amazing results for such a cheap mod. Once again my calculation were right and my Steam Deck will run cooler and quieter from now on.
head to my website at get templates they fit all lcd oled original cover or even aftermarket one to show you how good is template for original steam deck cover i will show you this clip of me aligning template with logo two red dots are on top of the screw holes hold on place by screws and now here i'll draw outline of the logo from beneath of the paper gangster precision now happy drilling also with original cover you have to remove this black tape just cut out piece directly on top of the fan so yeah what are you waiting for this was fun project and i'll be for sure making more modifications to my steam deck so stay tuned thanks for watching and see you next time